we have close to around 70% on the coal side or the fossil side, I would say, and 30% is the different renewables, solar, wind, hydro, and nuclear. Even in this mix, the Indian car I am talking about, I am not talking about any car which is outside India, but the Indian car have much lower emissions on a lifetime cycle basis. In the EV car manufacturing, the maximum amount of carbon is being consumed from the battery manufacturer. Correct. Because chassis remains same, whether it is uh, ice or the EV, it will have the same amount of energy, but the battery manufacturing consumes. So on the manufacturing side, you have a larger say of carbon than ice, but on the operating side, you have a much larger carbon on the ice side than here. You are saying the EVs are equal to or slightly better than ice? I would say better than ICE in terms of decarbonization. If I remember, it's ICCT report and they have clearly come out with these studies. The Indian EVs are cleaner by 30% to 50%.